it is currently 12.06 a.m. I just made myself food. My cat just comes around. Bongi? <laughs> adorable. What an adorable motherfucker, man. I wanted to have a more of a serious tone in this video, considering the fact that I find this quite heavy of a topic to cover. The topic being grind season is on. This is the time for grind season. This is the time for grinding. This is the time to work. For the past six months, I've been lazing around, procrastinating, being a bullshitter, being a piece of shit, homeless, not homeless. I'll say this. Potentially homeless, retard scumbag. And I completely understand it. I completely understand all my family's taunting, all the family pressure that's put on me. I completely understand every, all, every single bit of it. Because I don't have enough results. I haven't worked hard enough. I haven't grinded hard enough. And I made this video because I wanted to say the grind season is officially on. It's currently Saturday, the 4th, 12 a.m. in the morning, 2023. Tomorrow, I'm just going to be grinding. After I finish my food, I'm going to do a bit of work for like an hour until 1 a.m. I'm going to be grinding the entire day tomorrow. No more Discord chats with the boys. No more fucking wasted time. No more bullshit activities like gaming and Roblox and Minecraft and all this stupid shit. Rainbow succeed. I'm done with it. I'm tired of being an idiot. I'm tired of being a piece of shit good for nothing. A bullshitter. I cannot wait for my new stock to come in in late February. Because I've got my little business going on. I'm a college dropout. Well, I'm welcome to the real world. I have to get a job soon. Pressures are mounting up. I have to tell them 18. Then I have to get a job. I don't have anything against jobs. It's just the work, the work life, the low middle class grind, the work life balance bullshit thing it is just immensely depressing. At least for me. If you're happy within it, then amazing. Happiness is few and far between in this day and age. If you're happy within your 9 to 5, amazing. But tell me the last time. You saw a person who is genuinely happy within the 9 to 5. No one, no one was happy in the 9 to 5. I didn't even make, let you pause. I didn't even pause to let you even answer. I don't care, all right? No one's happy in the 9 to 5, according to me. me. Right? If you're happy in your 9 to 5, perfect. But I'm not happy with my 9 to 5, so I want to do something ulterior in order to get a life that I want, which is complete and utter financial freedom. This means shutting down all of my current activities of procrastination bullshit. This means targeting everything that I'm doing so far that I've been that have used that I have personally used in order to procrastinate. My friends and Discord, talking bullshit, doing bullshit, watching YouTube, watching even the self motivational informational videos. I'm not executing most of them. It's all bullshit. It's pissing me the fuck off. Because I'm achieving nothing in my life and I have never felt this frustrating ever. I remember first man's stick or twist philosophy. Very, very powerful. It's on my wall. Stick or twist. And I remember even now, I weighed the decision in my head while cooking and exercising in the kitchen like a madman. Like a crazy madman. I was shadow boxing. I was doing push ups in there, incline, decline push ups, like an absolute madman. I <laughs> 12 a.m. in the morning, blasting music. My poor neighbors, man. But listen, I was weighing in my head the decision to actually drop my current friends I really, really love dearly. And what even one of them told me, even though he likes to waste his time as well, you are. Sp you are a person that wants to do something with your life, but you're spending your time with bullshitters, with idiots, with stinky gamers. And this really weighed on me. Stick or twist? Am I sticking with these guys or am I twisting? Am I changing the narrative? Am I doing anything productive? If I was really, really twisting, changing the narrative, I would be grinding non-stop at my business, grinding non-stop at my YouTube, grinding non-stop on my e-commerce, grinding non-stop, 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 pushing, 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 grinding, grinding, grinding. This is grind season, bro. I can't afford to waste any more time. I'm almost 18. It's worrying. Very, very worrying. 
I'm swallowing and spit a bit because I'm thinking of that. The passion of time is eternally daunting. Tyson Fury, Tyson Fury said it best. The embers of time burn for no, wait for no man. Some shit. I don't know. Fuck. I don't, I don't care. Time waits for no man. I completely, utterly understand that. I asked these my friends, like, what are you doing with your life? Like, do you have any plans? What are you going to do later on? He's like, no, but that's my shtick. The fuck? I'm hanging around these idiots? Of course I'm going to be lazy. Of course. You are the five, you are the, some of the five people you hang around the most. I'm hanging around idiots. Of course I'm an idiot. It makes sense. That's pissing me off, man. Piss me off. I don't be an idiot anymore. I want to be financially free. I want to be wealthy. I want to be happy. I want to spend time with people I love. IRL in real life. I'm tired of this online bullshit. Sitting on my computer all day with my fucking hunchback ass. <laughs> I'm tired of this. I'm done. My cat looks at me. You can't see his ass. How can you see his ass? I'll put a picture up. Really, so cute. Why give me that look? I love you. You know that? Come on, say hi. Say hi to the viewers. No. Look at the camera. He never meows. Okay, 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 okay. Grind season's on. It's on. Stick or twist. I'm dropping all my current friends. This is nothing personal if they watch it. If they watch the video, it's nothing personal. It's the fact that I've wasted too much time with you guys. The fact that I, I feel like I'm going nowhere in my life with you guys. It's the fact that you guys are lazy pieces of crap. I wanted to change you. And if I get really, really successful, I'll offer you a job. Like, you're probably... Listen, I'm going to be realistic. You probably won't get anywhere. You get a job. Finish school. Get a job. Da -da 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 -da. It's like the classic. Very, very classic, boring lifestyle. Amazing. With me, I can't afford to do that. I can't afford to waste time. Neither can you, but you think you can because it's socially acceptable. It's not, just because it's socially acceptable doesn't mean it's okay, all right? Just because you're in school and you, you need to focus on your homework and all these other bullshit, it's, it's just this thing that's a waste of time, honestly. You don't even like it. What you're doing it doesn't really relate to the career that you wanted to chase on later in life. It's bullshit. You know, maybe social experience, but most of these guys aren't social. And even the guys that I knew that were social, they're stupid. They're amazing. They, they don't know what the fuck they're doing, alright? The way it goes. Just because it's socially acceptable doesn't mean it's okay. Just because you have homework assignments and college assignments, da -da 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 -da, all that bullshit, doesn't mean it's okay for you to slack around with your free time. We only have so many years on this planet. We only have so many, t so much hours, so much time. So there's all, there are only so many tomorrows. That doesn't make sense. There are only so m many tomorrows. Yeah, that does make sense. I don't know who said that. Was it Mark Cuban? No. Oh. A thought dawned on me while I was cooking and exercising, and it was, do I want to live mediocre? Do I want to live and die mediocre? Because that's the reality of the situation for most people that live on this planet. They live, breathe, die mediocre. They even breathe mediocre. They even breathe properly. They breathe through their mouth. <sighs> Type shit. I do that as well. And I thought to myself, do I really want to take the advice of mediocre people in order to become mediocre? And this thought just crushed me. It, like... When I have these thoughts, they're both equally beneficial as, how do I say this, crushing. Because it kind of wakes you up. It's the reality. You gotta wake up. You gotta do something. Come on, Jimmy. The fuck you doing? You're wasting time. You're being a dickhead. You're being a jackass. It's all your fault. You're really, really doing on me. T 
TLDR, main message of the video, 10 minutes. I don't even mean to reach 10 minutes. Well, YouTube advertisement, guys. I have one subscriber on this channel. It's <laughs> uh, funny. That's funny. <sighs> Woo! It's nothing personal, guys. It's nothing personal. I'm not gonna be on tomorrow. I'm not gonna be on the day after, the week after, the month after, the year after. I won't be talking WhatsApp. I won't be calling your ass. Well, I, I care too much about these guys. They don't give a fuck about me. Genuinely. Like, I call them. And I tell them to hop on VC. I fucking message them. I add them in chat. They don't give a fuck about me. And if they do, they don't fucking show it. At least the way I want them to show it. Maybe they're busy. With what? Schoolwork? They always have free time. I'm the one that calls them. I'm the one that fucking brings everyone together. I'm tired of doing all that bullshit. I'm done. It's nothing personal. When I'm, ri when I'm balling, when I'm rich as fuck, I'll offer you a job. And then we'll get brief conference again. But listen, for now, stick or twist. And I'm choosing twist. Peace. Is that better? No, what intro do I do? I don't know, I don't care.